How many poker hands are there that have at least one red card? Well, first, how many poker hands are there? There are a number of possible poker hands, as we saw on a very recent clip, is number of combinations of five things chosen out of 52. Okay, the number of poker hands with no red cards is what? There are 26 cards that aren't red. Out of those 26 cards, we're choosing five. So that we can get poker hands with no red cards by choosing five objects out of 26 where the order doesn't matter. So that the number of poker hands with at least one red card is going to equal the number of possible hands minus the number of possible hands with no red cards with no red okay which is going to be C of 52 5 minus C of 26, 5. And you can calculate these numbers readily enough. We already calculated this one, or at least got down to the last multiplication. And this one's going to look very similar, except that this number is going to be a whole lot less than this one. So you're going to see that almost all the poker hands, well, almost all is a mathematical term that we we'll probably better not use here, a very large proportion of all poker hands will have at least one red card. There just aren't that many that don't. This is a number that don't. This is a number that do. And again, this illustrates the principle that the number that have some property is the number in the whole universe, the number, a total number of possible uh, objects or results, minus the number in the complementary set, the number that don't have the property.